Uh, let's see here, how we get started. Sorry about that. B uh, video within a video. This video, we're going to talk about the next chapter, which is how to create a business ad account, okay? What is a business ad account? Basically, we're trying to make sure that after we've created a page, we want Facebook to know that we're an actual business now, okay? So in the first video, if you haven't seen it, it's very important for you guys to watch it, all right? So once you do that, let's go ahead into uh, create, let's see here, I'll put this link on the bottom, right? And so what you're gonna do is look at this page right here, and we're gonna go to where it says create an ad. It's gonna take us to a weird place of Facebook that perhaps you haven't seen before. Uh, but the most important part is that when you're on this gray top, you know, whatever, click on those three bars right there. And what you wanna do is go to business settings to see how things look like as a business. And from here, you're gonna go ahead and create a business. You see that blue button up at the top? create business that's what you want to do right so as you can see right now you know we have our own we have a whole bunch of pages that are listed under it then we have this other one called smart buy center so again this is what we want to create we want to let facebook know that we're creating a business all right so you go ahead and you name the business name you got to keep everything uniform right so we're going to call it my coffee shop okay you're going to put your name and you're gonna put your uh, business email address. So for now, you see, you know, this is just for testing. We're gonna put our spam email address, uh, resolutions design. Uh, we don't answer any emails over there. So uh, we're just gonna go ahead and put that in there just to register it. And then it's gonna ask for more business uh, related questions regarding where you're located. So we're just gonna pause right here, fill this information out, and here we go. Once you have that filled out, you're gonna see this dialogue to confirm that email address, which you'll do on your spare time, but we have now created a business, right? So this part is important. Once we create a business, you'll notice that there are some checkpoints that we need to do as part of your business manager, right? Remember in that first video, like I said, that we created a page? We're gonna go ahead and link that page into this business so that Facebook knows that, hey, that, biz, that page is not just some page. No, that's attached to a business. So you click on that. We're gonna go ahead here, add a page. All right here is that if you already created a page, right? We, they want the, the URL or whatever, right? So in order to find that URL, let's go back to our first tab and let's see how we can find that URL by clicking over here, looking at all our pages that we created. Let's go ahead and click on the coffee shop, right? And let's click on that URL at the top. We'll click that URL, copy, okay? And then let's paste it to see what Facebook finds. And there it is, it's all the way at the bottom, the one that we called the retail company. We click on that one and it says, yep, that's the one, that's us. We'll go ahead and add that page. Remember this registering the page into the Facebook business. We're gonna go ahead and press close. That part is done. The next one now is to create an ad account. This acts as a wallet. Like what are you gonna pay your advertisements? You need to go ahead and create an ad account, right? So um, again, this is pre-recorded, so I'm talking over a pre-recorded video. Uh, we're gonna go ahead and click on where it says uh, add ad account, okay? I'm um, going to click on right here, and it's going to ask you, do you want to add your own? If so, if you have another ID, you're going to put that information there if that applies to you. But I believe that in our scenario, in this example, we're starting from scratch, right? We don't have an add ID account. So we're going to go ahead and cancel off of this and go back into that dialog to see if we could go ahead and create a brand new one, which is all the way to the right. Create an ad account, okay? I'm gonna click on this one, and right here, again, it's gonna ask for the name. So, same business, my coffee shop. The time zone should be that, wherever it is that you live, dollars based on your location, and then we'll go ahead and click on next. Once we go ahead and click on that next button, that creates an ad account that's attached to your business, okay? And this, what we're gonna use it for is for the business, for the My Coffee Shop. Let's go ahead and press create, and then Facebook will go ahead and register that, 
Right here, what it's asking is, well, remember you have your personal individual who's gonna be responsible for this. What kind of permission should we give them? We should check all, and you can see on the left, there's my name, Edwin Anthony, right? You're gonna click on that bubble right there to make sure that me as a person, I have access and all full privileges to do whatever it is that I need. And there it is, it's done. So we're gonna go ahead and click close because we've already created an ad account. And that is the end of this video. This video part two, what we've covered is how to create a business account with Facebook and how to attach the page and how to create an ad account with Facebook, right? And then of course, you know, all the other properties, as you could see here, you could play around with to see what's cool, what's not, whatever. But that's the end of this video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. There's gonna be a part three where we're gonna talk about now the famous pixels. How do we get that? All right, hope you watch the next video. Like and subscribe.